Hi, my name is Cami Wong, and I will be teaching you how to make fried salmon with my fellow culinary students, Sammy and Kimber, here at Hilo High. We hope you enjoy the video and follow along. You will need two tablespoons of shoyu, a little bit of oil, two packets of salmon, half a head of cabbage, half a stick of kamaboko, half an onion, about a quarter pound of char siu, one carrot, and a third of a can of Spam, some green onions for garnish, and two eggs. So this is how you cut a head of cabbage. First, you're gonna cut it in half. Take out the core. and then slice into thin strips. Make sure to keep your hand in a claw shape so you don't risk cutting your fingers. Make sure you wash your veggies such as your cabbage, your carrots, and your green onions. Before you cut your carrot, you'll need to peel it. If you don't have a separate cutting board, just make sure to wash it between each cutting job. After you peel your carrot, you'll want to cut it in ovals. And after you cut them into ovals, you'll want to cut them into thin julienne strips. Julienne are like match-like slices. Next, we will julienne the onion. When you julienne an onion, you will cut it lengthwise from the top to the bottom. We recommend that you use a separate cutting board to cut all of your meat products. First, start by cutting it into slices and then into strips. Kamaboko will also be cut into julienne strips. Just like the kamaboko, we'll also julienne the Spam slices. Next, we will julienne the char siu. First, cut it into small slices and then into strips.
You will cut the green onion into thin slices to use as a garnish. Now you're going to cook your scrambled eggs and then cut them into thin strips. In a frying pan over medium-high heat, add oil, then add the spam and char siu. When spam and char siu are lightly browned, add cabbage, carrots, kamaboko, half of the green onion, and onions. Continue to stir fry for a few minutes until brown. Add the cooked egg, simon noodles, and dashi packs. After stir frying, add the shoyu. Stir fry until shoyu is incorporated, then transfer to a serving plate.
You can garnish the dish with the rest of the green onion after plating. Thank you everyone for taking the time to come and learn how to make fried salmon with us. Have a great week.